Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Outtoos. In this video, I'll be showing you how to log in Taobao account. But before we start, hurry up and check out the self riches under this video. So let's get started. In this case, for you to basically log in into your Taobao account, what we need to do here is we need to access their official website. In this case, let's go open up any browser that you have here. Go to Taobao.com. And from here on, we're now ready to log in. Now, by the way, for you to log in, you first need to have your account created. So if you don't have your account yet, make sure to check out our channel. We have a tour on how to create your account. And also, if you're having troubles using the website itself, like for example, uh, you're not yet proficient with Chinese, well, I would suggest you to first uh, visit our channel. We actually have a tutorial on how to translate the website itself and the app itself. But in this case, how do we log in? So usually at the top right of your screen, you should see your uh, kind of like profile here. It's going to say good afternoon, but go ahead and click on the orange icon that you see here or orange button here. Go ahead and click on the sign in now. Now from here, there's actually multiple ways on signing in. So first is going to be the password login. Now, the only downside with password login is if you haven't modified your security settings yet. So, for example, if you haven't set a password yet for your account, you won't be able to use the password login. But the good thing about this one is you also have the SMS login, which in this case, you need to enter your phone number and you need to get the verification code in here, which in this case uh, can be really fast, especially if you just created your account. This is the easiest way of logging in. Now, also, alternatively, alternatively, if you've created your account via your phone and you've already logged in your phone, you can actually scan the QR code that you see here on your screen here through the use of your phone. So if you want to log in using SMS login here, just enter or select your uh, country code here. And from here, what we need to do is we just need to enter our phone number and the verification code that you'll be receiving. So first, go ahead and click on the get verification code here. And once you've entered your verification code here and click on lock in, you should be able to lock in. So logging in is pretty easy here. Either use the password login or SMS login. So remember that you need to put your mobile number and your verification code here if you're using SMS login. But for password login, you need your email as well as the password that you've set. But just in case, if you wanna use the QR code or scan QR code option here, what you need to do first is you need to open up your phone. So by the way, my phone screen is going to be at the left side here, just to give you an idea. And the right side is going to be the actual website. In this case, go and click on the Taobao application. And you wanna go to your profile at the bottom right here. And at the very top, you should see your profile icon as well as your account name. Now, in this case, you should see a very small icon that looks like a QR code. Go ahead and click on it. Just It's at the very top right here, just underneath the help and your customer service section. So once you click on it, it's going to open up this section here. Go ahead and click on the scanner option. And from here, what we need to do is we need to now go ahead and scan our QR code. Now, in this case, let's go ahead and refresh the QR code here. Let's actually refresh. It's going to actually initiate the login process. In this case, let's go ahead and enable this. Let's go ahead and allow it. And from here, what we need to do is going to ask you if you want to keep keep you locked in. Let's go ahead and click on keep for us to be locked in. And as you can see right now, we should now be locked in into our account. So this might take a while. So let's just wait for it to load up. And as you can see right now, I'm now currently locked in. And yeah, so that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.